They're on the site. Found him. There's three over there. Ronan's on that close side. Got that one. He's one shot. One shot. <laughs> What is going on everybody griffin here coming at you with some runway gameplay and today we're going to be talking about a new sniper in rogue company and no i'm not talking about a character i'm talking about a sniper rifle let's head over and check it out so we haven't got a new sniper since fixer was introduced and fixer was one of the og characters that was originally released after the game was in closed beta we got dahlia we got fixer bam we got a new sniper rifle we got a new sniper character Everything felt zen in the universe because everybody loves to snipe. Everybody wants to snipe. And the tear was one of those weapons that when they introduced it was very complicated to say the least. They have reworked and reworked and reworked the sniper rifle so many times ever since they introduced it into the game. And I understand you want something that feels rewarding for players to use. You also want it to be something that is balanced and doesn't upset how the game currently flows. I get that. I understand that. And I also understand why it has to be, you know, tweaked and, and messed with so many times to try to get it into a more perfect state so that it doesn't upset that balance of the game, but it also does feel rewarding for people to use. And it finally feels now like it is in a pretty good position. So with that being said, when are we going to get a new sniper rifle? I know that it is very hard to bring new snipers into the game, much like we just talked about with the tier. It is something that is supposed to feel good. It is supposed to feel powerful, but it's not supposed to completely upset the balance of the game currently. And I think that there's a couple of things that they haven't really explored where they could actually introduce these type of weapons into the game to make them feel rewarding, to make them feel good and to not upset the balance of the game. Uh, let's take a look at sniper rifles, uh, something like um, Overwatch or Paladins, right? You have sniper characters in those games that have a three-tier charging system for their weapons that charges over time to increase the damage of the shots. So you're always going to get that headshot multiplier regardless of any weapon that you use inside of Rogue Company. And that's good. That's supposed to be there, and, and that is always going to exist in every shooter game. But with the thing with the with a three tiered sniper rifle system like that is where you actually have one bar that fills up whenever you scope in on it. Whenever that bar fills up, it does maybe 25% damage. Whenever it gets to the second bar, it does 50% damage to the character. And when it gets to the third bar, it does 75% damage. And if you hit someone in the head with the third charge, then it would be an instant down, just like the sniper rifles that currently exist in the game. I know that this would be something that would be really hard for the developers to kind of go in and really balance the weapon out seeing as how you can buy perks and also upgrade the current weapons in the game to where you can immediately pull them up and you can immediately uh snipe someone with them and down them like the 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 ttk for the sniper rifles is absolutely insane in rogue company and much like every other game if you're good with your shots if you know what you're doing you can absolutely drop people and just feel like you're being just untested on the battlefield whenever you're that proficient with the weapon but if they introduce a system like this, they could also add other perks and benefits into it that allow you to be more successful in other areas of the game. Like it could be something kind of like the way that Widowmaker is in Overwatch to where whenever you're not scoping it in, it is essentially an assault rifle. It does a little bit less damage than an assault rifle. Maybe it has a uh, uh, range uh, issues like range fall off on it so that or damage fall off on it so that it doesn't feel like it's something that can outclass and outcompete some of the current assault rifles in the game. But it would be very interesting to put that in players hands and then they would still also have access to secondary weapons if they if they wanted those. 
uh, that would be a very interesting way to do that. And there's a couple of other things that they could go in there and, and use that weapon with. They could change the scope up a little bit so that it gives you a different type of view whenever you are sniping. And I'm not talking like the fixer view where you see the hit, heat signatures. Uh, it could be something else like a night vision type view or something like that that accomplishes something kind of similar to what fixer already does, but in a different type of way. Maybe whenever you're scoped up, you can see deployables. Maybe whenever you're scoped up, you can see the direction that rogues are looking like you know there's a couple of different things that they could add into something like that um to make it different to make it unique but to make it more valuable to have on your team since it is a team based game at the end of the day Another thing that I thought would be very interesting that they could use as a sniper rifle, and you could also set the hip fire up to do a very similar thing, is a weapon that charges. Something that whenever you're behind cover, you want to hold that button down, or whatever button it is, to charge that weapon up, and then once it gets to full charge, it releases just a devastating beam out of the end of that weapon that does a significant amount of damage and depending on where you charge that weapon up to whenever you're holding it dictates how much damage that it actually does do over time and the way to balance this out and to make this feel worth it is you can increase the size of the hitbox based on the percentage that that bar has been charged. So at 25% charge, maybe it's the same, roughly the same or smaller than the current sniper rifle uh, bullet size, right? Like projectile size. Uh, if you're at 50%, maybe it's a little bit larger. Maybe it's something like a uh, switchblade rocket or um, something something like that. Maybe the Ronin knife. Uh, and then whenever you get it on up to 100%, the hitbox for it can be so large that whenever you see a group of enemies, you can just kind of fire it into those enemies. And then it's going to hit someone and do something to them. Uh, it could down a couple of people, but you would get a decent amount of damage output whenever they're grouped up. Uh in order to be more successful with how you're actually operating that weapon. There's several ideas that I feel like they haven't explored yet, and I'm not exactly sure why they haven't gone in and explored these options, because there are several, several ways to approach a sniper rifle in a video game. It's a video game at the end of the day. We're not grounded in reality anymore, because if we were, then there's a lot of things that wouldn't be happening in-game right now, whether they're bugs or features or both at this point, what nobody really knows. So we can take these ideas, and then we can go crazy with them and come up with something very unique and very interesting. The question is, will the developers think outside the box enough and be dedicated enough to try to bring a new sniper into the game in order to make something like this happen. I know that there's been a couple of sniper rifles that were leaked in some of the PTSs where they were tweaking and messing with things on the back end. So they do want to introduce a new sniper into the game. But the question is, how are they going to do it? Is it going to be balanced or is it going to be another tier situation? Because if they introduce something into the game where it's another tier situation, they might as well just hang that up. And I think that that's why they haven't introduced one yet. They've come out and said sniper rifles are hard to balance. It appears to me like they don't want to take the time to learn how to balance the sniper rifles or possibly think outside the box to bring a different type of sniper into the game that would balance itself if it is designed well. But be sure to let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you want a new sniper rifle introduced into the game? And if so, what kind of sniper rifle would you like? What what would what play style would you personally enjoy? The two that I mentioned earlier would be something very different, something very unique, but it would feel very, very rewarding, and it would create a nice challenge for players, especially since they're not used to mechanics like that, and I think that that would be something fun. But be sure to let me know what you think. Also, be sure to check that description for links to Facebook, Discord, and Twitter. Those are the places to contact me. If you haven't already, please be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. If you've already subscribed to the channel, then consider hitting that join button to become one of the 256 crew members. Lastly, on Thursdays from 8 until 11 p.m. Central time sundays from 10 a.m until we get tired i will be streaming here on youtube so if you're interested and available please feel free to stop by and say hello there thanks for watching guys 940 dude in there now sometimes less is more they crushed us did before, I don't know. Does that sometimes. Right, they're hard B. Yep, they're already in here.
Fuck off with the bullshit. Saints resin right here. He's down. I forgot. He's on me. This one right here. The corner. He's he's dead. Did you say you went down for a second? What the fuck? <laughs> it with the devil. Yeah, right. I got some pretty sweet sniping clips. I'm gonna put them in my fucking sniping montage, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Happen. It's very effective, though. Unfortunately, I would be okay if they just took it out of the game. To be honest. Who like people? What storm high res? I the mean, gates, dude. Yeah. Whoa, put it back. Like, yeah, right. Yeah. 